literally doing anything to stay relevant. Does anyone actually give a f about her? Why are we keeping this girl relevant? Your 15 minutes are up. Your joke was funny for two days. Stop. Y'all really thought I was done? I'm just getting started, baby. <laughs> well, now it's my time to talk. Check out my podcast every week. Talk to them. New exercise every week. Subscribe to that thing. The moment we have all waited for is finally here. The most popular slash requested podcast in the entire world. I even had a timer set for the second it drops. If I was a doctor and, you know, my patient was dying right in front of me and the podcast was right there, the, the patient has to wait 40 minutes. If I was Avenger saving the city and the world is about to go come to an end, if the timer went off that talk to us first episode is finally here, the, the evil people have to wait before destroying the world or maybe they will, but it will be worth it because I watched the first episode of talk to us. Come on, Haley, it's not that bad. All right, it's time to get out of the bed and quit rotting. Haley, get up. All right, I'm ready to talk. So I wanted to start my podcast out here in Belfast, Tennessee, where I was born at and where I've been ever since until a few weeks ago and everything changed. No, really, I even learned that you can't bring a box cutter on a plane. <laughs> so we'll be talking about all the crazy stuff that's happened since I got into this mess and the stuff that me and Chelsea like to do before all this happened. And I want you guys to get to know me better than Hawk Tua. No, it's uh, tuh. Uh, like, you uh, really gotta put you your emphasis in. Yeah, you're not saying tua. You're saying tuh. You know? Uh. Like, you gotta really put your back into it. I was so hyped at the intro of this podcast that I was doing the same thing that they were doing at the same time in real life. <laughs> tuh. If you've been around the channel, you know who the Hawk Tua girl is. We've covered a couple of videos about her. But if you do not know who she is, she was in a street interview literally like, I think, two, three months ago. And she said a sentence that took the internet by storm. You gotta answer this. You got it. What's one move in bed that makes a man go crazy every time? Oh, uh, you, you gotta give him that Hawk Tua and spit on that thing. You get me? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't get you. I think you got to uh, demonstrate. And now she's an um, entrepreneur slash influencer slash content creator now. And after that, she wasted no time after her viral video and went on and get herself, got herself a manager, an agent, a lawyer, a bodyguard, everything. The agents and the managers, they did their magic and she was popping off at events, charging up to thirty, forty thousand dollars just to just to be there because she's the face of the internet the podcasts have been paying and milking the shit out of her you know viral video her viral face her you know famous line as she says it Tuh. spit on that thing you gotta you gotta give him that Tuh. Tuh. And as i covered in the last video it got really fucking creepy <laughs> do you really or were you just having a laugh there i was just having a laugh there <laughs> so you don't you're not a but spitter <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's all nice. Fit. No, no, it's fit. Is, is, is My it friend, she is not going to be spitting on your thing. Just give up. Give, give, you're embarrassing yourself. Walla, you're like a 56-year-old man. You don't have a wife? He 100% fantasized before she even got on the show and later that night had a hug to a dream from Haley Welch. Now, she's been going around on other people's podcasts, but then, you know, her managers and agents, I'm pretty sure they teamed up with the Jake Paul's company and the sponsor of the whole thing better, the gambling uh, shit. They came all together and, you know, Jake Paul, as the businessman he is, he decided to do this whole thing for her and obviously get a huge portion of her money. Well, let's, we're not here to talk about that. We're here to talk about the how the podcast actually went. The first video on episode one, she has the guest. The guest is called Whitney Cummings. Now, first of all, I want to apologize for Whitney for having that last name. Now, second of all, she she was running the show. It wasn't her, the Hawk Tour girl was like, it felt like she was a guest in this whole show. They went on, they talked about rewriting history, why it's time to stop shaving your vagina. Okay, let's watch this. Okay, we're all trying to stop shaving your vagina hair. Don't stop shaving your vagina hair. I, no, I don't know where the fuck Whitney's going with this. Don't stop. No, no, I realized we're going to grow it out and put babes in it. I was dating creeps the longest time and I didn't realize yeah. I was baiting them by having a bald pussy and Botox. <laughs> of course. If a guy looks at pubes on a vagina and is like, never. Never mind. This is, you know. He's a sissy ass bitch. Yeah. That's exactly. Yeah. yeah. We're I'm glad you think that way. Yeah. You make me want to grow mine out and like finger wave it or something. <laughs> <Ugh>. <laughs> Yes. I know you're very grateful that you clicked on this video and you're, you know, with us with this whole the vagina controversy here. They went on and the guest of the whole show was asking the Hawk Tour girl Haley everything as if, you know, Haley was the guest. But maybe it's the beginning. Maybe she's going to get used to it in the 
upcoming future and she's going to you know get better at this whole thing she needs to be hosting it she it feels like she's being hosted but another thing i wanted to point out is the fact that the advertisings that these it's not only her, there's a lot of people who do it as well. The gambling advertising. Let me be real with y'all. I was never the biggest football fan. I honestly don't even get the rules that much. But what I do know is I like having fun and winning money. And Better Picks lets you win up to a thousand times your money. The app is super easy and it makes it a thousand times more fun. Just pick your favorite players or the men that you think are cute in my case and predict what they're going to do in the game. Get them right and you can win up to a thousand times your money. So download Better, play Better Picks. Use the code TALKTUA. And let's hit some lineups all NFL season long. Put your money and get a thousand times more. T t take my money. It is all yours, Miss Haley, just because you said so and I love you so much. And I'm going to start gambling because you told me so. Now, I don't need to tell you how serious gambling is. It doesn't matter if how much they're paying you. I've been reached out from like gambling uh, companies to promote their gambling. And there's a huge chunk of money in it. But it is never worth it if you're promoting something this serious because the addiction can lead up to ruining people's lives and in some occasions ending people's lives. So I honestly lose respect for whoever. It doesn't matter if it's like Kai Sinet, anyone. Whoever starts promoting gambling, honestly, it is the worst thing I can see if a person... It is worse than promoting scam crypto. Yes, I said it. Promote condoms. Promote shit like that i don't know promote sex dolls i don't care even if you're selling fake black kumbas i'll have more respect for you than if you're promoting something like gambling because of how serious it is now my favorite part of this whole podcast is this part where they're going to teach her friend how to do the hawk toa hawk toa tutorial sessions one more time i can't do it as good as do it you do it no you do it hawk to <laughs> you, go. you gotta put like an emphasis on it, like you know, like, really two. Like, yeah, say it. All right, all together. Hot two. Hot two. Hot two. Say it aggressive. Like, like, really. Like, you're Please. mad at the day. You're mad at it. Hot two. Yeah. She's hot two. Spit on that thing. I'm hot two. It's a shit, shit on that thing. Shit on that thing. Please get her a hat that says shit on that thing. Shit on that thing. Okay, maybe not. Shit on that thing. That respect. <laughs> Honestly, after watching and following Haley Welch, the Hawk to All girl for the past couple of months, it makes me want to give... No, actually, no, that's fucking gay. Now, for the past 20 minutes, I've been literally sitting and looking at my monitor. I'm really thinking, why would anyone want to follow someone who said Hawk to All? And the only logical thing I can think of is her bubbly personality. Because what the fuck? How are people fans of this Hawk to All thing? This is just... I know this is just her saying, but... How can people follow up with this whole thing? It has to be because I can't think of, you know, if you're in a concert and she just pops out of nowhere, pops out of the backstage ass and goes like, I'm going to say it. I'm going to say it. Hawk Twa. I can't imagine that people, you know, watching the whole concert, listening to the whole concert are going to go be, go like the second she says Hawk Twa, everyone's going to be like, Whoa, oh my God, she said it. I'm so happy. This is the best time, day of my life. I'm pretty sure people cringe out and they're like, okay, well, who is she? Get her out of stage. And I'm not speaking out of hate. I swear to God. I just want to know why is she so famous? How did it start? Is it the, the deal with the guy downstairs? Is it because she got so fast into this whole industry? Is it because everyone's using her for, for her virality and there's a lot of collapse happening? She's going up. But the way it looks like, it is going to be multiple episodes that are already recorded and they're going to be coming your way. So stay tuned for that. Hawk to uh, <laughs> I've been in so many situations where I've I love someone but I don't like them. Mm. I'm like I'm chemically addicted to you, like I love you, but I don't want to hang out with you. I don't like talking to you. It's real shit. And I think that is the most important thing about a relationship, the fact that you love them but you don't like them. They try to talk to you. Shut up. You knock them out of this world. You love them but you don't like them. Yes, sometimes maybe, but I don't know what the fuck they're saying, honestly, at this whole point. All I know is she dabbed in this video. That respect. Now, every content creator goes through their prime time. Usually, it lasts around six months, and she's in her prime time right now. After six, seven months, we're going to come back and see how she's doing. She's enjoying her prime time. There's going to be more episode on this hawk, the twa talk. We're just going to have to wait and see until the next episodes drop and see if they're good or not. I doubt they're going to be any good. I give it... 15 to 20 more episodes until the whole thing just falls through maybe if after the fifth sixth episode they're not gonna they're just gonna stop doing this whole podcast thing because their prime time is over and right now she is booming because it is her prime time for whatever the talent that she has i guess is having a good personality is a talent 
But yeah, let's see what the future brings. And finishing up with this video, I'm going to hit you with that. The most amazing outro you have ever seen on this channel. That respect. <laughs> <laughs> that respect. Yes. That